Is your team struggling to perform, but you're not really sure what's going on? Are you having challenges with delivery, but you can't really put your finger on what the actual problem is? I'm going to provide some insights today for you. Hi, I'm Peter Nickel, Data Science CIO. One of the challenges we experience as executive leaders is we focus on all the qualifiable aspects of delivery. Number of product launches, number of projects delivered, number of sprints released. And we forget some of the softer side of delivery, the values, the beliefs, the behaviors that that team embraces to ultimately enable delivery in a successful outcomes. I want to share a couple of different ideas today that help dial you in as a, a leader to those aspects, the value beliefs of and, and value beliefs and behaviors of your team and whether they're really performing or not. The first idea is a business value ability assessment. And what this does is it helps measure the maturity and if you're connecting behaviors to outcomes. So it focuses on is your team sporadic and occasionally does stuff or are they defined and usually do stuff or are they attainable and always do stuff or are they optimized and really focus on dialing in business value. What this does is it allows you to get a better framework as a leader of what behaviors and aspects are driving and contributing to successful delivery. The second assessment is called a cultural readiness assessment. And what this does is it tries to better understand which internal and external factors are impacting your delivery and your delivery success. It's focusing around stimulating, shaping, and growing demand. But really the benefit is trying to understand what the beliefs and behaviors of your team are enabling. And are they enabling the right outcomes? So it focuses on is budgeting done from the top down or bottom up? How are you engaging in success? Do you celebrate failures and successes or only successes? How are you trying to enable those team members to rise up and be leaders? When you go through these different exercises, it's really interesting to see the results. What you see is a lot of correlation and causation between these behaviors and how the team is actually performing and their outcomes. And you can start to get a better understanding of the softer side of delivery. Hopefully, you can try a couple of these different techniques and they can work out for you. If you're interested in more of the details, I'll put a link in the post so you can get some additional information off datasciencecio.com. Hi, I'm Peter Nickel, Data Science CEO. Hope you had a great day.